queen's childhood retold in never-before-seen diary of close friend, laugh and giggle. The queen's childhood years during World War II have been recounted by a close friend of the monarchs in a never-before-published diary from 1940-45. to 45. The Windsor Diaries, released on May 4, written by Eladia Fitzlin Howard is a book containing her rare diary entries. Ems Howard grew up with the future monarch and Princess Margaret. The detailed entries from the diary recount the close friendship Ems Howard had with the Queen and Princess Margaret as well as private conversations they shared about day-to-day -day life and Prince Philip. Isabella Naylor Leyland, Ems Howard's niece, adapted the book after Ems Howard passed away in 2001. Speaking to town and country, Ems Naylor Leyland said, I think with the Queen. It was a sort of a typical teenage friendship, and they would laugh and giggle and enjoy each other's company and didn't discuss anything too serious. Princess Margaret was this sort of naughty one. And I think Eladia adored her, really, and admired her spirit. And, unwittingly, she often wishes that Lilibet, as she was called at the time, had more of her sister's spark. But, of course, we all know that it's extremely lucky that she didn't and that she was a much more steady character. The book serves a dual purpose as a historical document and a set of evocative accounts that offer new insight into the royal family. Ems Howard met the Queen and her sister when she moved to Windsor Great Park to live with her grandfather at Cumberland Lodge during the war years. Ems Howard was the eldest of the three girls and had a very close sisterly relationship with young Elizabeth and Margaret. In excerpts from the diary, Ems Howard fondly refers to the Queen and Margaret by their nicknames, Lilibet, L and M respectively and the king and queen as K and Q. She also named the nannies and governess around Windsor Castle, Crawfee, Maudie and Mrs. Knight. In an excerpt from the book from Thursday, April 3, 1941, Ems Howard wrote of the first time she heard Prince Philip's name in conversation. She wrote, They said something about Philip, so I said, Who's Philip? Lilibut said, He's called Prince of Greece and then they both burst out laughing. I asked why? knowing quite well. Margaret said we can't tell you but Elle said, yes we can. Can you keep a secret? Then she said that P was her boy. Maudie asked me if I had one and in the end, I told them it was Robert Cecil, with a muse Del. M said she was so glad I had a beau. We all laughed terribly. Elle says she cuts photos out of the paper. I must say she is far more grown up than I was two years ago. When I left, Lily Butt said, we part today the wiser for two secrets and I biked home feeling very happy and also proud at being let into such a great secret, which I shall never betray.